Hello, this is Michaela. Peter is here also, but he's not mic'd up. Um, <laughs> we're gonna start Lairs of Fear. We're gonna call this slot ASB because there's not enough character space for And So Begins. I already checked. <laughs> As Peter tries to type in the full thing. Ampersand? Or Ampersand? No. So ASB it is. Who? What? ASB. I'll pick this select profile to load. So, Layers of Fear is a unique, immersive game experience in which every decision affects the narrative. As in life, it is the doors you open, the memories you take with you, and the shadows you explore that will define who you are. This may be our game, but it is your journey. Okay. Uh, should I check the settings, do you think? Probably not. Okay, we're just going to start a new game and it will do some text at us. Let's see if I can read it. I know how you must feel. Lost. Alone. Hopeless. You probably deserve it. But even for you, there is still a way. A way to bring it all back. The one precious thing you ever truly desired. Finish it. Every portrait that is painted with feeling is a portrait of the artist, not of the sitter. Oscar Wilde, the picture of Dorian Gray. So here we are, and so begins a layers of fear. This is Michaela. This is Peter for the channel, and so begins. <laughs> We're going to start looking around. I'm here now, hi. So neither of us have played this game. I think we've like seen it a bit. And it felt very seasonally appropriate. I'm I'm playing it. If you're wondering, we're playing on PC. Look and at that, that butt. butt. <laughs> that is a happy baby. Oh, what this? Try R two. R two. Oh. It's like a, a dog muzzle. A muzzle, yes. So we have spinny aroundy button. Okay. So your controls are left trigger be run, right trigger be interact, left and right. Oh, I was telling you. We sort of have the grab and push and pull system, a bit like amnesia. Well, it said right stick move, which isn't right. Hmm. Do children play while your mother's very, very dramatic? Yeah, admittedly. So. Oh, no, it's saying right stick to move. Yeah, so right stick left and it'll open the door. I did notice there's a tiny pair of shoes there. Right. What's the thing that someone asked Hemingway to write a, a, a sad story in four words and he said baby shoes never worn? I think we just want to read the middle bit. And as there's a crackle of thunder, we can see an artist's triumph. Gallery opening wows critics. Some call him the new. Others compare him to Van Eyck. And one awestruck critic who wished to remain unnamed went as far as to invoke the spirit of the great Leonardo, the best of the turtles. <laughs> Anywhere you slice it, like a pizza perhaps. <laughs> The exhibition proved an immense success. Distinct style has been praised for its unique combination of Renaissance influences and more progressive techniques. The artist himself attended the event 
in the company of his beautiful fiance, looking stunning in her black gown, revealed to us exclusively that the couple are indeed ex expecting. <laughs> Scrolls over. Expecting. Pregnant, I'm guessing. Yes, I think the two names are blacked out, yeah. and it's Caravaggio. Caravaggio. Yeah. Right, let's do it again. Some <laughs> call it. Oh, oh. What? It's perfectly readable, though, game. Or indeed, expecting, though. Well, that's a bit clearer, admittedly. Yes, the, the names are redacted. I'll have to try and remember to use the uh, bouton. But it's what I do. Any, any. A newspaper article about me that I've got. I'll black my name out I in see. case it's going to be used in a horror game later. What about this one? I'll read this one out. Dear sir, we would like to ask you to cease bothering our pest control specialists, as well as refrain from sending us any more of your highly inappropriate letters. I'll have you know that my mother is a respectable woman and does not take kindly to such accusations. All of our employees that visited your house reported absolutely no signs of a rodent infestation of any kind, and as such decided not to act further than a prophylactic spraying. <laughs> I don't know why that tickles me. Uh, please treat this letter as a final warning, or else the next envelope you'll receive will be from our lawyers. With best regards, Carl Denton, Pesky Pests, Pacification Co. I like the name of the company. That is a name. I also had prompts, many, many prompts come up. And open, oh, I've got to remember not to walk back, but to pull back. What game do you walk backwards? <laughs> I don't know. Is that one of the, um... Was that penumbra or something? Oh, I've got a zoom button. I have to remember to use that. It's pressing on the, the sticky. Oh, that's uh, one it didn't tell me about when I had a look at the controller mappings. Well, because I was looking for a crouch button. Which we do not have. Nope. Bob and whiskey. Superior. Superior. Old. <laughs> But enough for paper me. <laughs> Can't spin this. My god, this game's laying it on thick. It's rather. It is, yes, I'm going to take my time and look at the things and rub myself on everything. Cigars, maybe, or dominoes. Massive, massive dominoes. Another pizza reference in this game. Did I open this one? I don't think you did. I'm not sure what those are. Dishes. Stacks and stacks of dishes. Uh -huh. Gonna... Looks like there's a note on this door. Yeah, I'm thinking, should I read the obvious note? Sir, uh, I didn't touch the workshop just like you asked, although I can't imagine the mess that's inside. Also, if you care so much for that room, maybe you should pay more attention to where you leave the keys. I brought them back to your office. Have a nice day. Unsigned note, yeah. I'm gonna keep looking around this room first. Well, before going the obvious way forward. Yeah. Yeah. The under, you could look at the understairs one. The door you went past. Oh. I well, would, I'm not sure I'd regard this as the understairs door. No, you're door, probably right. Should I still go for it? Yeah. Oh, that's the basement. We're going to leave the basement. Well, you'll, you'll have to pick where to go eventually. I want to look around this room first. Yeah, it's sort of a bare space. The door over there. Ha. I'm sorry for yesterday. You were right. I overreacted. It's just that this isn't about me. It's about her. Everything I do, I do with her best interest in mind. I guess I've always believed that in an imperfect world, it's wor worth to strive for perfection. 
Ah, now I'm starting to sound like my father. I will work on my temper, though. Promise, we'll talk later. I love you. Honestly, that text might be easier to read than that text. Mm, it's bigger. Mm. It's a, a brush and a small book and perhaps a picture and a lighter. Yeah. Do always enjoy that you can zoom in on games. Some linens. Oh, we can access a, a second level as well and the third level. That's a, a stamp. Some uh, medals. Oom peep. Mm. Perhaps an ashtray. Clothes. Yeah, it's pants, shirts. More we towel. We had a place to put them, but ah, <gasps> this drawer locked. is locked. Can interact with nothing on the surface. Bathroom. Can I go in the bathroom? Yes. Have light. Oh. Yes. We have light. Wonderful. Turn the tap off. That turning the tap on. There we go, we turned the tap off. There we are. We have a reflection, yeah. A little indistinct. Yes, we rather flooded the bathroom. In the sink. <laughs> Who has a table lamp in a bathroom? This guy. I guess. Oh, those towels are filthy. And here. Perfumes. Oops. Yeah, the parfum. And those old tiny squeezy bottles. Yeah, very cool. Only interact with that. Click, uh, do the exam because I'm curious if it no it doesn't have all the great go back I think I'm better off reading that yeah Achilles prosthetics company 3666 Ronald Boulevard PO box 616 Lakeside Rose 34980 so it must be American because that's a zip code uh, customers order number name address all redacted quantity one description a below knee prosthesis how the hell did they... I can bring the thing up if you... I think you might have to. How the hell did they fuck up the length? Oh, is it the wrong length? That must suck, admittedly. Hmm. Does that mean we have a prosthetic leg? Someone has a prosthetic leg. No, oh, someone hasn't changed the toilet roll. We'll do a quick courtesy flush down. Nope. More towels. Aha. Ah. What is this? Rat poison contains Antu, effective when used as a bait poison. Water. Water poison. Tracking poison. Active ingredients. Alpha naphthyl theomia. 20% inert ingredients, diatomaceous, zart, colour pigment water, better naphthyl, erosis, 80%. Uh, for this one, there's no text either. So we've had, we think we've got a rat pipe pet problem, or? But the rat company disagrees. I say rat oh. company, I mean uh, exterminator. That seems so much brighter now. Anything else on the desk? Big sheets of paper. Grandfather clock at like ten past midnight. Or almost quarter past lunch times. Mm. But considering how dark it is, how dark it is outside. Probably what you said. This book or box of whatever cannot. Is 
room is also open. Is that open enough to it your satisfaction? Stay open. We've got some broken wine bottles. It's an old style. Yes, this is a kitchen. We have uh, hanging pots, uh, some candles, this oven here. I assume those do wait on anything cooking away. No, you've used your oven as storage. I guess that's semi accurate. What well, might not be the oven? I think this whole thing is the oven. Oof. Well, I mean, it might be like a place to store food so it doesn't get cold. So I heard that's a thing on like the underside of cookers, but no one ever uses them, so they obviously get uh, dusty. And you wouldn't want to put food in them. Lovely flowers. Yeah. On this dark and stormy night. It is very. Being followed by this woman going. Ah, Aha, a note. note. Figured you'd be up all night, so I made you a little treat. You know? I bet even Rembrandt occasionally took time off from being brilliant and shoved his head. And shoved. Was that shoved? And snored. And snored his head off like the rest of us common folk. I know! Gasp. In other words, get some sleepy big dummy. I love you. Ah. Gales, we can poke. Columbia. Mid scale, maybe? Family scale, let's say. Another note there on the table. Note from Pestle, Iron. Various bits and pieces. Note, paint, R rose doll, burnt umber, sienna. Brushes times 25. What kind of brushes? Who know? Air fresheners, 50 packs. Apples, 10 kilograms. Booze, 30. Not bottles. Oh, it's crossed out. 5, 10, 30 should be enough. Mm. Also, I've never heard of burnt umber, but I've never seen sienna that isn't burnt. <laughs> it's always burnt sienna, isn't it? No, I, th I think of th th those are like the colours. Also chopped off the accent. It's Rose Dory. Mm. Fancy artist things though. Picture of a basket of fruits. Is Some this... of them cut open. Uh -huh. I mean it is. That's a roll dish. For casseroles. We have a lot of these identical bird plates. All the ones in the uh, china cabinets were like that as well. I don't like these really dark rooms. I'm going to leave them. I mean, you're going to have to explore the house eventually. I know, I know. If the room is lit up, it's fine. Right. Oh, it's locked. <sighs> right, so I'll have to remember we're coming back. You don't want to try that again. To the, what? <laughs> we're coming back to the basement and to the kitchen storage room. Not now? But I'm going to go upstairs. Okay. Don't do anything freaky game. Going up the staircase of death. There's a happy fellow. I'm expecting the art to repeat quite quickly. Probably, yeah. Who needs this many sitting areas? Donald's three bottoms. Oh, that opened by itself and made a noise. Well, I think it was open, but I think it did make a noise. That one's open over there too. 
That one's shut, but it has another nose. Right, let's see what's over here. Reasonably brightly lit area. No notes. Ah. Piano music, no readable text. It says. Da 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 da. I don't know what it says. Might mind if I tickle the ivories for the first time in my life? No, I shouldn't, shouldn't coin other people's jokes. Ah! Could you not? Especially when you're tickling the ivories for the very first time. <laughs> What does this note say? Been working all night. Don't wake me up. Mm -hmm. Dumbling all around, dumbling all around, dumbling all around. So oh, now I'm worried I've done the thing the game wanted me to do. I think that's okay. Hello? No one's in the bed. That is a grubby bed. Mm. Wash your sheets. Also, the problem with music like that is it makes me think of that lady you watch. Oh, yeah, R Rachel Manxy? That's the one. I say you watch, I quite like her as well. Yeah. It's like a glasses case, some sort yeah. of... Uh, Letters, like a... Maybe Look, that's a pair of glasses. cigarette holder, who knows. So, the new face of music. A night at the opera becomes a night to remember. Bring this up. Redacted might not be a household name yet, but just give her time. The incredibly talented multi-instrumentalist gave an astounding performance last night, winning over even the most ardent naysayers. She was simply astounding. I haven't seen such passion energy and skill in years. Stated famed pianist Daniel Rich... Richter? Richter. Richter. Oh, I guess. He was not alone in his praise. It seems that even Anthony Giles, one of Redactor's harsh, harshest critics, had finally seen the light. Giles had previously made disparaging comments about the artist, stating that there's a more to performing music than enthusiasm and a pretty face. When asked if, after witnessing last night's performance, he regrets these words, Mr. Giles gave us a look that can only be described as a mixture of awe and embarrassment. Pressed for an answer, he simply said, yes. We caught up with the star, redacted. That's not even up on there. Hmm. Can't spin. Oh, shirts. Oh, shirts. Ha. A smashed mirror. That's rather. We and have, a letter. We have no reflection in this one, though. Galactic's grand opening in flames. Disastrous fire at the new department store leaves dozens fighting for their lives. The long-awaited opening of the Galactic Department Store turned into hell on Earth when the building's wiring burst into flames. While the majority of the visitors managed to reach the emergency exits in time, several unfortunate attendees were trapped in the back of the building, having no choice, no chance to escape the raging inferno. The exact number of casualties has not yet been determined, although it is estimated that at least a dozen people have been severely injured. The owner of the Galactic, Ronald Sheffield, Sheffield? Sheffield, has so far declined to comment on today's tragic events. Mm. Another hairbrush. A ring. No inscription. Jeweled ring. Not sure what the stone is. Those little drawers are inaccessible. Inaccessible. 
got a cane and another letter. Oh, look at this. Sorry, couldn't sleep. The legs have been acting up again. Figured I might as well do some work. I love you. Many books. Ah. <laughs> Cupboard full of bottles. Is that what you're going to say? It made like a squeaky noise, like a rat is the problem. Yeah, I thought it was going to be some sort of rodent. But not the cute realistic kind, but the, the horror film kind. I guess. I'm assuming that's deliberate. More clothes. In this room. I'm gonna leave this suspicious room. Tiny little candle. Looks like a tea light. Yeah. Let's check out this room because this is the one that made the noise, I think. Whoosh. Oh. Is that a light? Yep. Let there be light. Oh, much better. Maybe the set doesn't work. Yeah, the, the middle ones aren't working, but all the out around the outside lights are. Right. Yes, the trailer park lights. <laughs> ah. oh, I thought I saw something come up there. No, don't think so. Maybe it was just the draw above. No, no. It's a picture there. Oh, it's a book. True story behind the picture of Dorian Gray. Was it true all along? Oh, I can't actually. An astounding investigation by Professor Alastair R. Malmax from the Miskatonic University Very cute. uncovers the secrets of this magnificent work by one of the all time greatest writers, Oscar Wilde. Was Dorian Gray real? Did he have an insight into the esoteric? Is the novel filled with cryptic clues for the initiated? Read to find out. Spoilers, no. It doesn't say spoilers, no. Oh, sorry. Publishing details at the bottom there, I think I can... Other novels by the same author. Uh, the something link. The missing link. I think the missing link is. is Bigfoot Real. Oh my god. Uh, three days in Venice, on Venice, on Venus. A memoir of an abductee. It does seem a bit of a strange change of novel. It's just whenever it's like, was Dorian Gray real? What, like a real person, maybe? Did he have a magic picture that aged when he didn't? No, Probably not. Yeah. Yes, but Miskatonic University, so it's a good... Uh, good reference. Cthulhu Mythos reference, yes. H.P. Lovecraft's... Lovecraftian. Eldritch. Yeah, the fuzzy It is said that royalty's first child was weird and hairy. I don't know. Yeah. I said you turn the lights on, though. It is. I like it. I'm sure it won't punish me later and turn them all off. Did someone fall over, maybe? Or perhaps threw it down in rage. Also, it is that time of type of situation where it's like, nice chair. Tiny stool you make someone sit on. Let's have a look. Right. I'm sorry, I'll make it up to you. Tonight it's all about you and me. Let's make it special. And you promised. I think it's different handwriting. Yeah, different hand. Yeah. Oh, I've got a key. I'll let leave that for a sec. This is little red riding hood. Yes. The wolf. They meet. He eats her. They meet, they eats. Wait, wait, wait. Go back one. Does that say anything? No. Okay, sorry. He's hiding in a bed. And he eats someone else. That looks like he's eating No, her. he's eating the mother. 
Yeah. So he meets Red Riding Hood, goes to the mother's house before her, eats the mother, disguises herself as the mother and stays in the bed, eats the child. Okay. This kills the man. Letter here, I'll bring up the thing. My dear friend, let me ask you one simple question. Have you completely lost your goddamn mind? I know you're going through some rough times right now, I really do. That's why I have agreed to let you do those illustrations in the first place, for all time's sake. I even deliberately gave you a trivial task because I expected Little Red Riding Hood to be something you can draw in your sleep. What I didn't expect is to get this demented nightmare fuel you submitted for a kid's bedtime story. There is no way in hell I'm using this, and I already regret agreeing to a payment in advance. Please, get your shit together. Your old pal, Liam, Liam Brickstone, Whispered Tale Publishing House. Yes, the only problem I have so far is it's a bit... The... It feels like we're in a much older time than people would really talk like this. In, Certainly in uh, putting in pen to paper. In letter form. Also, those are great. Uh, but perhaps a little inappropriate for a children's book, wouldn't you say? I mean, Red Riding Hood is about a, a girl that gets eaten, you know. Like, depending on the version, there's a guy who chops the wolf's stomach open and pulls Grandma out. That's a good thing, isn't it? But it's all quite, still quite grotesque, though, I mean. Okay, we got a key. Do I just go use the key, or do I check out the other open door? Yes. That probably isn't helpful, though. Oh, there were noises. I can see movement. Through the window. Is it the mobile? The light from the window is hitting a mobile if you look at the... Actually, no, that doesn't make sense, no, I does think it? it's branches outside. They don't look like... Well, I suppose they do look like branches a little bit. Yeah. No light switch, which I'm a bit confused by. Just try and look around. Small child's room. Many bears. I don't think that says anything. I mean, beer. <laughs> Tiny uh, playset. Yeah. Little painting. Pictures of Mummy and Daddy. Yes, Daddy looks happy. The girl, the dog person in the middle, has no mouth. And I think that's a very scribbly mummy. I don't believe it. The sun isn't drawn in the corner. <sighs> That's where the sun goes. But you have many letter blocks. More don't you? blocks than you can poke a stick at. It'd be purple light. It's quite pretty. It is actually. I like it. That Cot. is a big bed. Yeah. Tiny brush. Tiny? Oh, yes, it's like a rattle. Yieldy rattle. Dog. Many, many creepy dolls. Okay. I don't even think you need to say creepy. Because. Can try that dog? Oh, I guess I could. Oh, no. Locked. They're all locked. If you haven't watched it, please check out our Dark Corners of the Earth playthrough. It's very good. Hashtag throwback Friday. Exactly. Or is it Thursday? Right. 
The only one I know about was out of touch those days. Mm. I'm gonna try the key here. Aha! Uh -huh. It worked. The grand We have entered the studio. Oh! First time it's done that behind me. I like the splashes of red. Oof. So a lot of brushes. Maybe Does he use all what <laughs> Does he use each one once and then throw them in the back? They're all snapped in half. It's like you're using your equipment wrong, I'm afraid. Have a look at the painting last, I think. Yeah. <laughs> Is this one also? These are also not uh, painting equipment you need. Just going to shut that. Hmm. Many locked. Many locked cupboard cupboards. I think they're all locked. Yeah. But these ones aren't. Huh? I'm so sick and tired of us talking through these notes. We live in the same house, for God's sake. Come talk to me when you're done, before you go to sleep. Paint and palette knives and brushes and many books. That's the same draw contents we've seen before, actually. That's fair enough. The arrangement of the uh, pipe. That's uh, what sleep paralysis looks like. <sighs> There's that other ba baby butt. I think that's our first repeat. Is that another mirror? Oh. It's just you stepping on the broken glass. Oh. Have it right this time. Is it time, do you think? Oh, actually, that might be a minute. No, and there's a draw as well. Two draws. Draw in a cupboard. But I'll go no higher. Lost. You deserve it. Finish it. That is indeed what it says. It looks like he sort of whited out the letters or something. Yeah. Um. She makes you pull it down. That's rubbish, that is. Hmm. He's done the foundation background. Hmm. Okay. What now? I suppose I'll keep exploring. There's doors we didn't open. Has any of the things in the room unlocked, perhaps? I thought you might find a key as well. I don't think I did. Then perhaps it's time to leave. All right. This isn't the, the way we came in. Oh, game. You turn on, can you turn on those wall lights? It doesn't look like it actually. Oh, 
this one's on. It's just really dark. Where are we? Everything's very grimy. It's freaking dark. That's uh, just out of reach. <sighs> if you missed it. I did miss it, is the thing. The lovely squelchy noise by the window. It's because it was wet from the rain uh, coming in through the window. Could be anything, I can't say it. Or more, but... Probably nothing in this, just decorative. Oh? Well, shut my mouth. Reconnect with your partner. Rebuild your relationship. Rediscover the joy of marriage. Rekindle the flame. Don't worry, you're not alone. Perfect relationships may look great on the silver screen, but the rest of us mortals have to face the simple truth. Nobody's perfect. And you know what? That's fine. In fact, Many loving couples struggle with day-to-day -day life in a relationship. This does not make them any less special. It just takes some work, and we're here to help. Our consultants, all trained experts in their field, will help you identify the source of your troubles and deal with it at your own pace. Whether it's simple miscommunication, money problems, or conflicting personalities, when there's a problem, there's always a solution. And remember... It's never too late. Most impressive thing about this leaflet is, of course, the fact that they've used word art. <laughs> it is very word arty with the, like, the, the whooshy text at the top, isn't it? Okay, do I just... Well, it's not going to be the same location when you leave, is it? No. Dimensions Euclid wouldn't know. Lovely girl. Mm. Lady at a piano. Oh, we seem to take that. I'll keep that for later. Yes, I realise the sofa says something. Is it? Yes. Talking sofa. Dear sir and madam, we must kindly, albeit strongly, urge you to keep your voices down during the night. Your no, I'm marital. Think, I think you're going to have to hit the X button. <laughs> your marital problems, while regrettable, are a private matter and should remain that way. They are certainly of no concern to us and especially our children. Please consider that not everyone is a freelance artist. Some of us have to get up early and work for a living. We need our sleep. We must also warn you that if things continue the way they are now, we shall be forced to call the police. Sincerely, your very tired neighbours. Mm. So this house is so big, I don't think you could hear other people, but um, going in circles... Much alcohol. They seem to be worshipping Baphomet. Mm -hmm. Or a goat like figure. Oh, I don't like that creepy noise. It's just the wind. Very serious and stern looking gentleman. Oh, this was bad last time. This time, nothing. It's books, full of books. No light switches? I think the lights are technically on. 
It's just very dark. Fair enough. But... Almost make that out. No, I can't make that out. See that game. <sighs> but if you notice, there are numbers. Eight, five, four. <sighs> Eight. Oh, no, I was going to. I don't want it to advance, so I don't want us to miss stuff. Save the date of something and something. Uh, someone requests the pleasure of your company to celebrate their wedding on Saturday the 9th of June at St. Luke's Chapel at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Paints. Is there some people? expecting to see a face at some point so it was at eight five four eight five a lot of whispering in this box yeah why is this box full of whispers the past holds back look closer the thought alone that the most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So, will you marry me? That's kind of a gross sentiment. I'm gonna put my name on this woman. You love her though as well, right? Hopefully. Ring a ding ding. That wasn't there before. No, it was not. Never forget. You're gonna start looking at me, are you? Eternal Darkness did that the best. Oh, that's so good. We've also done a, a let's play of Eternal Darkness Sanity's Requiem, which is fantastic. Oh, oh. this is a pushy outy door. Some of the doors you can like open. Yeah. Chair shouldn't rock on its own, but you know. I should stop looking at it, it kind of doesn't look good. I'll just approach the chair. It stopped. So freaky. If I don't look at it, will it start again? Perhaps it was all a trick of the light. Mm. You've been snooping around my workshop again. For the last time, you are not allowed in that room. Even if the door happens to be open, I forbid it. This is your last warning. Next time, you'll have to look for a new job. Is this to their house staff, perhaps? Big cupboard. Like, surely there are other little drawers. Okay. Can you tell what that is? Kind of brack. The game is incredibly dark, to be fair. Oh dear. No light switch, I don't think. Not any lamps. 
Um, not that I can see, no. It's the thing above the mantle. But it's just an animal head. It's an interesting picture. Another picture. <gasps> of the stern looking gentleman. Might be a switch next to the. Oh, thank goodness! Yes. Throw a little okay. light on the situation. Uh, uh. Okay. While Michaela recovers, you can see that there's quite a lot of detail now that the uh, light is on. Yes, I quite like that it led us to the light, and it led us to the light. That was very good direction. But my god, could you stop it, game? I suspect it's not going to. That was like a trap door, I think. Yes, I realise I'm playing a horror game. I, I am scared by things. But I will press on. I think you read the last thing. I can't. Make that out, so, my love, even though you have not been born yet, I can already feel your presence. It's simply amazing. I just can't believe how lucky I am. A year ago, all I had was talent and ambition. Now, against all odds, I have a career, a loving husband, and you. I have never been a deeply religious person. I guess, what other people look for in a sermon, I found in perfecting my art. But now, I can't help but feel like there's a higher power watching over me. They once told me that I would never succeed as a musician. Now, I'm playing sold-out concerts at some of the most prestigious venues in the country. They also said I had a difficult character, and that I would never find a soulmate. Guess again. Finally, a doctor once told me that I would never be able to have children of my own. And yet, here you are within me. I am quite possibly the happiest woman in the world. I love you so much. Thank you. And yes, this painting was over there. This stern person. It's a bookcase that's facing the other way. And I assume we're in the, like, basement that I didn't go into, maybe? Perhaps. Pull this lever. Oh! Yes, the lever-operated door has led us back into... Is this the same room? That it, wasn't it there is, before. It is, but the doll's over there. And the stern and man is here. Can I walk over this? Just, just open again? No, okay. Is 
sliding back into place. The doll has ended up on the antlers of this fearsome beast. Should I try the doll? Mm does not look correct. They all look like two merged pictures. A very interesting effect. Almost like a hologram. I hope you don't mind that I take my time. Um. <gasps> flew off the wall and hit the other side. And on the back it says, Paint Deep Lies. And lies is flashing. And it looks like you can also interact with it. I shall. like some sort of note. Now, a tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like that. Hold that pose. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> That's him painting her like one of his French girls. Mm. And not reading the frickin' text, because there was more <laughs> words in the subtitles than the actual dialogue. I think it's kind of swaying gently as well, I don't know if you've noticed. It's very odd. Yes. Were you, were you waiting for me to confirm? Oh, yeah, I suppose. <laughs> Oh, that's just the squeak of some wine bottles. <laughs> uh, Nothing to worry about. Surely there is, though. You can listen to the relaxing crackle of this fire. Yes, there was a wine bottle that just rolled across the floor there, <laughs> away from you. <laughs> well, that did say something. This painting still isn't back. Okay. Check out this one. A chest under there as well. That's strange. I think the people are all crying. Well, their eyes are bleeding. This game is scary. I never did look up. 
But before we go through this door, I've also just noticed that he does have a limp off the, the leg being too short. Nice. But uh, yes, before we open the door and proceed, we're going to leave it here. And we'll see you again next time for more Layers of Fear. <laughs>